you've ever wondered where male models live, they live in Williams Bag in super cool buildings like this. Damn, this is amazing. It doesn't look as creepy as the outside. Hey Jerome. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Good, best apartment so far. Yes, I'm renting it as well. But That's fine, living the dream. I'm renting a shoebox, <laughs> which does not look like this. It's a bit bigger than shoebox. Really it's fun. yours. Tell us what you're making today. I'm gonna make some, it's like a layer of vegetables with some couscous salmon on top. Why is some shit in the fridge? So you said you saw this recipe online? Jamie yeah, Jamie oh, Oliver. Yes. He's got some good stuff. So when you cook, are you pretty healthy, or are you a junk food fiend? Yeah. Okay. Have some weeks that I'm like not. Yeah. Female models, you have to kind of yeah, for the most part, you have to be healthy. But for yeah. guys, do you have to be strict. Okay. Okay, so that protein shake in. I don't really care. Like, okay. as long as I keep working out of You don't mind, yeah. Giving out the right message, Centro. <laughs> yeah. All the aspiring male models are like, awesome. Yeah. So, what are we doing? Are you prepping yeah, this? Okay. So, you have two red peppers. My parents both had a full time job, so my mom, so it was like, oh, I would be nice. When I come home, dinner is ready. Okay, I'll do it. Wow. And I enjoy doing it. Nice meat with the meal. And then it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gives you a, a good feeling. That's really interesting. Yeah, I would just watch my mom when she did. Okay. Make it my own. But yeah, a lot of recipes that I make are basically just my mom's. So kind yeah, of a family yeah. recipe. What's like something that you always remember her making? I will always remember how to make lasagna. That's my specialty. So Men's Fashion Week finished on Sunday? Yes, we... I'm guessing you do a quite a lot of shows. New York there's not that many shows. Okay. It's, it's not as big as Europe. Alright. Just walk in back from Europe as well. The longer you're in this business, the easier it gets. You don't have to see all the people anymore because they know you. It's mainly just now I'm hanging out with the lads. Just yeah? Because in Milan we've got like an apartment. So that's mainly why I do it now. Just traveling around. Yeah. Get to see the world. What's the coolest place that you've been to? Japan has so much to offer besides Tokyo. I bike from Tokyo to Osaka. Oh my god, what? Like, How long did that take you? It was five, five days. I actually went to Taiwan for a week. Oh my god, that's where I'm from! Yeah. I like it a lot. That's so sick! Amazing. Yeah, the food is so, so good. good. So you have all these street markets. Oh my god, it's so dangerous. And yeah. then you just don't stop being Did you? Movie. Yeah, yeah. No, honestly, I couldn't agree with you more. Everyone's like, no, it must be like the rest of Asia. And I'm like, no, trust me, you go there and it is so cheap and so good for the food. Definitely go to Taiwan, I would say. It's, this, it's, is like an ad, this is like an advert for Taiwan. Yeah. <laughs> we haven't been paid to say this, but we should be. <laughs> so cherry tomatoes, basically. One big onion. This is going to be the, the first layer, and then I put the couscous on top. Ah. And otherwise, so you do it in stages? Yeah, like I okay. cook that first, then I put the couscous on. Now the garlic. Do you want to open a restaurant? A small one where the locals come, like mm -hmm. local produce. Pop the tomatoes. And the... Are you dropping out one jalapeno? The peppers. It's organic, Ooh. hidden, pure salmon. So you got one baby. So basically when you put the couscous on top of it, that's going to soak up all the flavors as well. The best is to do it early, so like even the vegetables, so like so soak it up. And then mash it up in the pan. Wait until it boils. 400 grams of couscous. Like in the local market in Union Square, I could walk around like, yeah, and just not even buy any water in the push push. Like what's something that's like cliche about male modeling that people that people think it happens or is true? When I just started, my friends were like, oh, you're making a lot of money. Yeah, yeah. You make a decent amount of money, but it's not that you're like, yeah, in five years I can go with pension. I'm going to chess school in London, get yeah. into that, and save the money for whatever I want to start yeah. later. So, you know, you start traveling, every culture has different things. Yeah. You're like, oh, it's actually cool how to see how they make their uh, make their food in different yeah. cultures. That's why I really got into it. Uh, yeah, so I started cooking more. As a model, you have 
a lot of days I literally try to make a different recipe every day. Wow. It's almost, I, I, it's That's almost, a really good idea. The best thing you've ever made. I was still saying my lasagna. You're lasagna. Damn, I feel like I got the short end of the stick then. This should be lasagna. This, this lasagna is also, it takes quite long. I was just yeah. thinking about it. Have you downloaded Pokemon Go? How many Pokemon have you caught? I play when I'm out and about. I love it. Especially going. Yeah. It is quite fun because I, especially how I grew up with Pokemon. A guy quit his to job catch to all. catch Pokemon. Yeah. Isn't that nuts? Have a lemon over the quinoa. Splash a little bit on the on the sun. Let it sit for about ten minutes. Done. We should probably address the fact that this is the first thing. <laughs> This is it. She cooks as well. You make shapes though. <laughs> I've heard about the meal with no. egg white shape. Uh, protein. Protein, protein, but in the morning we make like um, oatmeal, or very smooth, like a smooth. Okay. You've lived in modern homes, right? I was when I first got to New York. I was in Milan, and then they're like, oh, are you going to New York actually tomorrow? I was like, oh, okay. I'm from a little village, it's like all nice houses. Yeah. Like, and then I was like, all the fences were like half ripped apart. Uh, like it's with girls and guys together. Nice. Sometimes it was a lot of fun as well. Yeah. But then other times it was just like either all the girls were fighting with each other, some guys said something, and then half of the people were pissed off. Like, yeah. Let's say tell me tomorrow. Yeah. And then yeah. The other person had an it's option for the same thing. Uh, and then apparently, like, they didn't get it. How many bedrooms? It was three bedrooms. It was like in, in two bedrooms, there were. Or two bunk beds. All the guys were cool. So like whenever the guys It was all the girls. <laughs> nice. And yeah. I mean like yeah, most of the time it was just the other girls as well. How you guys met? No, you guys we, met then? We met like well yeah. Really Did you say grinder? Yeah, I was gonna say bungle, but alright. <laughs> Our money agent too came to me around because he might have uh, an exclusive product. So, like, oh my God. Yeah, so with the new guys, I can take nice. time to show some Especially the younger guys. And so I was winning. Really young back then. <laughs> You're like, now I'm 100. Feels like that. Especially when you do shows now. Yeah. Because once you've done it a while, it's like, uh, what's your favorite show you've done? The first ever show was Gucci. Okay. Was, I didn't know anything about the fashion industry and that. Did you know what Gucci was there before? Yeah, like, okay. I knew like the bigger brands. My cousin worked in, in fashion. Oh, you know, Gucci, that's so cool, And yeah. I was like, I guess so. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because it's such a big show as well. Yeah. So I was like, oh, and I would open it, and the last minute they changed it. You always like the brand that pick you. What's the worst show you've ever done? You don't. No, I can't answer. <laughs> that it's actually another show, it's a presentation. I hate presentations. Everyone hates presentations. Once that I almost fainted, massive windows and it was sunny outside and I just think there were like six layers on. After a while I just didn't see the people in front of me anymore, so I was oh like, oh shit, that's not good. Right. That good. Go. Wow, that was literally ten minutes. Let's see how oh, Instagram no, friendly you can make it. That is <laughs> I'm not gonna make it Instagram friendly, I'm gonna try actually. Does this look alright? And then yeah. top it off a little bit of yogurt, Greek yogurt or normal yogurt. I've seen people doing this. Oh! Look at that! <laughs> he looks so horrified, he's like, yeah. Glenn, do you want it now? 